The return of the Sovereign. Welcome to Mojo Plays, and today we're taking a look at 10 of the most well-crafted player creations in Dragon's Dogma 2. Welcome, Arisen. We pawns have long awaited your arrival. Before we begin, we publish new videos all week long, so be sure to subscribe to Mojo Plays and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos. Keanu Reeves. We could all use a John Wick in our lives, someone who can protect us and have our backs in a fight, or just someone to do most of the fighting for us. Reddit user Devastator, and that's with a 3 instead of an E, has just the man for the job. It isn't John Wick, but rather the man playing John Wick. People keep asking if I'm back, and I haven't really had an answer. But now, yeah, I'm thinking I'm back! Yes, Devastator has gone and made Keanu Reeves as a character in Dragon's Dogma 2, and the similarities here, uh, they're uncanny. It's almost as if he was just scanned into the game like an NBA 2K player. <laughs> You're breathtaking! Commander Shepard! Let's see, what can we do without? It would be cool if we got a fantasy game that played similar to Mass Effect. Dragon Age might be the closest we have, but for the hardcore fans, there is a way to get your fix through Dragon's Dogma 2. Reddit user Chata Monkey managed to recreate the male version of Commander Shepard using the game's highly flexible customization tools. Some of the proportions do look a little off, but for the most part, we'd say Chata Monkey nailed it. No, you can't romance him. The only thing we can. We fight, or we die. Pan Am Palmer. It's almost surprising seeing Cyberpunk 2077 explode in popularity despite its troubled launch. Gee, it's almost like when we say a game is good, it's pretty damn good. That aside, if there was any character from the game we would love to see pop up in other corners of gaming, it's Pan Am Palmer. And Redditor Mizuka has given us our Pan Am fix. No joke, this honestly looks like Capcom could have committed copyright infringement. We know they didn't, and they absolutely didn't, but if you told us she was a secret character in Dragon's Dogma 2, we would have believed you. Shadowheart. Back at last. I feared I'd never be allowed to return. One of the coolest things Capcom could do to further promote Dragon's Dogma 2 is to have a crossover with Baldur's Gate 3. Unfortunately, licensing and legalities make that super complex, and so we must settle for the character creation tools. Reddit user ThrowRA underscore Deerling has made the crossover a reality by making Shadowheart, and they did so rather flawlessly. The facial scar, the silver hair, the eyes, ears, and lips, just about every feature of Shadowheart's face is perfectly replicated here. Mad props to you, Deerling. To be best, I escorted you. Lord Farquaad. I shan't allow any who harm the Arisen to go free. Normally, we would expect Shrek to pop up somewhere on a list like this. Heck, just about any game that features character customization has Shrek hiding somewhere. But YouTuber Sparky Boom Boom deviated from the ogre and gave us the iconic villain of the first movie instead. He is no longer known as Lord Farquaad, but Lord Chad Quad. Mock his stature again and he'll knock your teeth out. Some of you may die, but it's a sacrifice I am willing to make. Pikachu. Of course, we cannot go through a list like this without a little bit of nightmare fuel. One would think there was no room for turning cartoon animals and creatures into Dragon's Dogma characters, but someone found a way. Reddit user KillingJoke619 has managed to put Pikachu into the world of Dragon's Dogma 2, and it is horrifying. Look at it! Look at it! Look at it! I want all of you to look at it! <laughs> Charlie Kelly and Frank Reynolds. Over the years, there has been an influx in demand for It's Always Sunny in Philadelphia to have a stronger presence in games. Really, what would it be like to see Charlie and Frank take on the intimidating world of Dragon's Dogma 2? 
Wow. Uh, anyway, I started blasting. Bah, wow. bah. No, I don't see so good, so I missed. Then they ran away. I ran after them. Well, you can see that for yourself, thanks to the efforts of Reddit user Blurbs, and that's with two S's. If only the player character could talk, then you could mod in a ton of classic quotes from the show. I got you. I got you, brother. Oh, oh. oh no, no, you don't. Oh, what are you doing? Adam Sandler. Actually, he wasn't even a knight at all. <laughs> For some reason, we haven't seen a ton of love for the Sandman in video games. It's not like it's hard to put him in games, Adam Sandler has looked almost the same across every one of his movies. But under Dragon's Dogma 2's customization, Reddit user ConsciousCod47 has created a spitting image of the comedian. And if you want, you can even give him the little Nicky hairdo. Ain't that cute. The fix And then the crowd went nuts. Nigel Thornberry. Is that not so? But I can see this is no revelation for you. You can easily create some garish monstrosities in Dragon's Dogma 2 just by setting various sliders to either 100 or negative 100. As Reddit user XShots points out, one particular combination will get you everyone's favorite wilderness expert, Nigel Thornberry. Shockingly, this is nowhere near as haunting as Pikachu despite being a almost one-to-one -one recreation of Eliza's dad. At least now you'll have an excuse to acclaim smashing when you club an orc in the head. <laughs> that was smashing. Bully Maguire. If there is one hero the world of Dragon's Dogma 2 needs, it is the man, the myth, the legend, the meme. Bully Maguire. Yes, the Reddit user known as Rasamasala, or Rasamasala, it has given us the gift and brought the meme to the game. Look at little Goblin Jr. Gonna cry? You may not be able to dance and act cool around every village, but you will be able to rub some dirt in an ogre's eye. Unleash your rage until Mr. Dickovich fixes your damn door. This is something else. But what's the best player creation you've seen in Dragon's Dogma 2? Let us know down in the comments, and be sure to subscribe to Mojo Plays for more great videos every day.